Hey guys, what do you think I think of that right there? Well, hey guys, how's it going? How are you on this beautiful morning? It's a good one. Well, guess what? We're gonna head out to uh, Indianapolis, Indiana. We got a couple drops on this trailer. We're gonna go to Indianapolis, Indiana to a cold storage. When we get done with that, we are going to run over to Greenfield, Indiana and drop the rest of this load off. And then from there, we are going to go up to Chicago and pick up a load up there. Right now, what we have in the wagon is about the same thing I've been hauling for the past couple months. And instead of giving you details, let's just start calling it Lunchables. It's easier that way. To the point to where I don't have to explain what it is, you know. It, it, I mean, technically, it's stuff that goes inside of, I don't know if it's Lunchables. It, it'd be Lunchables and Lunch makers, there you go. Lunchables and lunch makers. All right, let's check the reef for fuel, see how we're looking. We need to top that off before we leave the yard here. Tires are fine, lights are fine. Did you guys see that? Look at this right here. Stuff's getting serious, right? That's when you know you're getting serious. They're, uh, there is one other thing I've been forgetting to tell you guys about. And, well, I don't know if I really want to tell you about it or not. Yeah. That's what I was going to tell you about. There's no way I'd kidnap that kid on purpose. She's a stowaway. She's a flat out stowaway. I would have never brought that one. She talks too much, and if you guys could tell, did you guys see what I was doing out there? I was hitting tires, getting things ready. Where was she? Sitting on the couch messing on her phone. Little Bud, he's out there hitting tires with me. You know, the little Bud is a jerkwad, so. Oh, yeah, so he's a jerkwad, apparently. We're getting them separated. Things are gonna go good. She's got her mask. I got my mask. We got her gloves. Oh, oh, let me show you something. So we are going to go ahead, hit the road, and get ready to go, you know? You want to know what oh. growing a mask is? When it could cover your eyeballs, too. I don't know what a kid is. Yeah. Then no corona going to get in your meat. I dropped her, guys. I'm sorry. I it have to tell you guys now chips. that I dropped her, fed her too many paint chips, the whole works. Let's swing over to the pumps, get some fuel in the reefer, and then we will go trucking. Talk to you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, what do you think I think of that right there? That's my stuff. You think that you think that's gonna pass my inspection rules? That's my stuff. You can't touch my stuff. She says it's her stuff and I can't touch it. I'll bite you. Sure bite me. I got rid of sharp teeth. I'll bite you. I'm taking offers. Yeah. Starting bid. Yeah. You wanna see her really get wound up and mad? talking about woman <laughs> don't call her a woman she gets mad I'm a lady. she's a lady an empowered lady oh my 
a guy now. I'm his twin. I just have hair. running for a little bit over 200 miles now we're still in Iowa kind of figured it'd be a good time to stop top the tanks off and more importantly clean your guys glasses there's a lot of bugs on this windshield I do have one thing that I'm very very concerned about right now I'm very concerned about if tater tot over here is feeling well today you have arrived at your destination. Gee, Jarvis right really Jar Jarvis Jarvis stop. really I'm trying to talk here man That's but I'm really concerned on the well-being of my tater tot. She may be sick. What? I have never heard her, never not heard her. She's being very, very quiet. We're talking maybe 20 words all the way across that 200 mile span. So if she has this virus and I don't make it, I want you guys to know thank you for being subscribers and thank you for being viewers. Okay, uh, we have a Jarvis. We like, have a Jarvis Like now. off of... Jarvis? Uh, Jarvis off of Iron Man, she says. Oh my god! Okay, maybe she is feeling okay. But that seems like a good time to remind you. If you're not a subscriber yet, guys, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Okay. I actually have stickers on my window now, so this means I'm getting serious. Oh yeah. Throw a thumbs up if you like the video. I'm supposed to say something about a bell. Ta Buddy's always telling me to say something about a bell, but don't miss out on any videos. I, I, I can't do the notification bell on the places I'm subscribed to, so I'm not going to ask you guys to do the same. We're, we're going to jump out, grab some fuel, okay. clean your glasses, and that's about it. There's no need to go inside the truck stop yet. Yes, there right. is. Your butt will get the virus. I don't. Yeah, I'm gonna beat me. I don't want to do it on the side of the road. I'll be back with you in a little bit. We got the fueling part done. Her butt is probably sick now. Her butt's not sick. Oh my god. You know, I want to take this opportunity that just, I've said it before, I'm going to throw out another shout out to Love's Truck Stop. We are in Waterloo, Iowa. They are the only Love's within probably 100 miles of Waterloo, Iowa. I want to give them a that a boy in the wise of cleanliness. Like tater tot. Was your bathroom clean? Yeah. My bathroom was spotless. The store is spotless. I mean, everything is dusted. Everything is sanitized. Their employees are wearing masks, gloves. Love truck stop. Once again, you impressed me. I haven't been in one for a while. But I actually stopped in to actually... Well, I got a girl with me. I got to go inside a truck stop right now. Because I'm sensible and I don't just whip my dingling out on the road and pee. <laughs> she didn't just say that. Just go ahead and ignore her. But hey, I got your glasses cleaned up so now we can actually see where we're going. I'm just saying. She's just saying. <laughs>
knows where we're going, man? Detour with absolutely no signs. Closed the interstate and said, guys, you're on your own. Find a route. Guys, guys, I made it elk call. Ready? Yes, I have an elk in my truck. Woohoo! Oh my god, there's a basset hound over there with a giant banana! back in the video and see uh, maybe I missed something you know maybe I didn't see a detour sign right or I don't know who knows we're about 500 miles into our day we got another 210 miles left before we get out there just checking to make sure all the lights are good had to stop and clean the windshield off again bugs are nasty tonight on those county two lanes didn't help it much. Oh yeah, and I gotta tell you, if I look back in the video and I see that uh, I missed something and it cost me an extra hour's worth of driving because of myself and not because of some stupid construction crew, then you guys will never see this and I'm talking to myself. Now if I happen to see that it was the construction crew's fault for not marking a proper detour, then you are see it. All right. Do you think there's any chance she made me... No. I asked her to make me two hot dogs. No. None? No. No chance at all? No. Come on. Back with you later. Guys, we've made it to Indianapolis, Indiana. This is where we're gonna call home for the night. Have I told you guys how much I just am blessed? I am blessed. My kids, I have two well-rounded little brats. You know, I had my 11-year-old little bud riding with me in the truck last week. Loves riding with dad. Turn around. I got my 14 year old daughter with me right now. She's a high schooler and loves riding with dad still. Well, she was a trooper today. She lasted 
626 miles before she finally looked over at me and said, Dad, I gotta go to bed. So she crawled in back and went to sleep. So she almost made it all the way out here. But I'm truly blessed. This is, this is awesome to have two kids that love riding with Dad still in the truck. Well, we're gonna call this a night. Hey, if you guys have any questions you wanna send my way about what I'm doing, if you have any concerns about what I'm doing or if you think I can do anything a little bit better, I am way open to criticism. I, I'll take it pretty good. Other than that, if you like the video, don't forget to like it. And if you think this is something you can keep watching, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. You guys have a good evening. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you tomorrow morning. Okay guys, settle this once and for all. When I say pizza, right there. Pizza with pepperoni for Armor Eckridge lunch makers. It's not Lunchables, but I've been told a lunch maker is the same thing as Lunchables.